there, welcome to Grown By. I'm Kara. I'm gonna be showing you today how to sell on Grown By and the very basic step of updating your farm profile. So here we are. Um, you may be on this welcome dashboard. So welcome start here. If you and if you're here, you can click right here on update your farm profile. If you are not on this screen, if you scroll down on this um, menu on the left hand side, there'll be a button that says farm profile. So you go there, some of this is filled in um, automatically from the text that you put in when you registered and claimed your farm. You can put in your website here. Um, let's see. Oh, you put in your email address, your phone number, and then your farm description. And this farm description is um, a real chance for you to describe who you are, what your farm does, um, the history of your farm, anything you really wanna it, uh, use to sell yourself and to sell the farm to your customers. Um, I am just gonna say farm description. Um, and sort of skip that step. I'll let you uh, do all the wordsmithing on your own. Uh, you'll have your address here. And then, then you have the option of adding any of your certifications. So th these are some of the certifications that we've worked with. Um, we do check these third party certifiers and auditors to um, just make sure that you are indeed on their list. And then you can add different photos. We encourage you to put in photos here that really represent your farm and show who you are and give a kind of image of the farm and anything you want people to see or know about you. Um, we'll put that one in there. And then for branding, you do need to upload a logo of some sort. Um, I will put in our Farm Generations logo here. If you don't have a logo, a small photo is fine. There are brand colors here. You can edit those if you'd like. Um, those show up sometimes in invoicing. Um, we hope to use more brand coloring in the future. And then you have the options of tags. So these tags are searchable and they're a great, a great way to kind of also convey information about your farm. So you might say pasture raised. Um, you might say women owned. Um, so anything else you want to convey about your farm, then you have the option of social media handles. My fake farm doesn't have any at this point. And then you hit submit. After you say submit, that'll all finish and take you to the configuring payments step, which you can see in the next video. Thanks.